I think we have a pretty good idea of the, the freshmen who are probably redshirting this year. I wanted to ask about Jamal Custis. He was a guy that got a little nicked up in training camp. I don't think we've seen him yet this year. Because we're now at the halfway point, is he a guy that you're looking at maybe saving for, for a couple of years down? We still got to we still got to see. He's uh, he was actually traveled with us this this Saturday. I mean, last Saturday to Wake Forest for the very first time. And we just got to see how he continues to develop, whether he's going to be at full speed where he can help us in the back half or not. But uh, he was one of our top performers coming out of two days before he got hurt. But would it make sense to maybe, at this point, consider a redshirt, just then get two more years with him? The word makes sense. Right now, we're still battling to, to be a, a bowl team. So we want to play our best players if possible. Mark? Uh, go back to the midterm thing. Uh, halfway through the season, could you give us a, a midterm grade of project? Your team. You know, I, I think we're still growing. Uh, obviously, there's been some shortcomings. <laughs> there's been some fantastic things that have gone on, probably things that have surprised a lot of people in this room. Uh, it, it happens. It, it happens with maturity. It happens with growth. The toughest thing that's been going on so far this year is just to have the massive turnover in personnel and then to have to constantly reteach or go back to a certain level. Uh, as the weakest link in your chain to start growing again, start building again on that foundation so that you can start doing more exotic things, offensively and defensively. Would that be a B? I don't want to put a grade on. You guys can grade it. I'll coach it and I'll make it better. Have you seen, have you gotten a chance to rewatch the hit that Kendall Coleman was ejected for and what you think of the play and the call? Yeah, I, I got a chance to see the play. I looked, o looked at it a bunch of times. I think it was a bang, bang play. Uh, you know, obviously, I think it could have been called either way. I'm, st I'm still hopeful that they, they reverse the call because I'm not, I did not see helmet-to-helmet -helmet contact. Now, he did go high on the quarterback. I thought it was a shoulder pad. I, I have, do not have the perfect look, the perfect clip yet. So if you guys have one out there to send me, please let me see it. But uh, this looked like a bang-bang play, the same type of plays I saw in the Miami and Florida State games that were on, on highlights. So they get to make the call.